There was something really off about this particular piano key, so I opened the back of the piano and it began to investigate. And I soon discovered a small little pouch. And like I always say, I'm a curious boy. So I decided to open it and uncover a message that will soon be something I very much regret. A series of unfortunate events were about to unfold, and you know how the saying goes, Curiosity killed the cat. What's up guys, it's your boy Ming. Welcome to today's video. I'm sure all of you guys have heard Chadwick Boseman, the actor of Black Panther, passed away last week from colon cancer. An absolute, absolute tragedy and it really put things into perspective for me. Oftentimes people are so focused on chasing the future, like so many people telling themselves, once I make a million dollars, I'll be happy. Once I meet that special someone in my life, I'll be happy. But I'm telling you, life is unpredictable. Tomorrow is not guaranteed. Live each day like it's your last. If you have a dream, Go after it. No more excuses. Yesterday, you said tomorrow, but there might not be the tomorrow. So just do it. If you have a crush on that certain somebody, what are you waiting for? Do something about it. Just, just do it. Just do it. Just, just do it. Like really put things into perspective. Really ground yourself and live in the present. Because the moment you stop chasing happiness, you'll become happy. That being said, if you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button for me. It would mean so much to me. Let's begin with story time. So like most Asian kids, I started learning the piano at a very young age. I wasn't like really good, but I'm still very, very thankful for my parents who have worked incredibly hard to give me the chance to learn and have the opportunities they never had. I'm curious, let me know down in the comment section below what instruments you guys know how to play. But as the years went by, my interest for the piano began to fade, and it was not touched for 10 long years. Left alone to collect the big dust. Until last week, I decided to play the piano once more and noticed something very unusual about this particular piano key. I instantly became Bob the Builder to see if I could fix it. Yes, we can. I opened the back of the piano and uncovered a secret message inside. Ever since I read the note, I've been experiencing extremely bad luck. Yeah. After I discovered the mysterious note, it began to make me think I was cursed with misfortune. Here's what happened. I've always noticed this particular key sounded really off tune. So I decided to open the piano and inside I discovered a small dusty package. Who knows how long that's been in there. I decided to open it up and took out a piece of paper. I unraveled it and read, Whoever finds this, you are about to experience the worst luck. I normally don't believe in this hocus pocus stuff until suddenly I turned around and what I saw made me urinate for 60 consecutive minutes. I immediately heard something behind me as I turned around and noticed a large biza in front of me. I opened it, and all my favorite biza was gone. <laughs> no more pizza time. Not only this, but I looked down and saw a stain on my favorite t-shirt. The one t-shirt I wear in all my videos. I went fast guy and locked myself in my room in absolute isolation. It has begun. Just when I thought things couldn't get any worse, I hear the doorbell ring like Santa Claus. I peed my pants right away as I heard the doorbell ring. As scared as I was, I fast guy to open the door and it was the Phantom Pizza Man. I opened the pizza box and inside was a photograph of my brand new car, but it was absolutely decimated. This can't be. I just bought it yesterday. In a dust of confusion, I looked in the corner of the photo and it was dated August 31st. Holy Clifford the Big Red Dog, that was tomorrow. I went super fast guy to check, and my car was completely fine. That means it hasn't happened yet. I examined the details of the photograph, and it appears there is no way anyone can survive a crash this severe. Is it possible that this hocus pocus stuff is real? And finding that note caused a chain reaction of all these misfortunate events? Was it possible that this photograph was predicting my own death? What do I do? Think, think, think. Brain blast! According to my calculations, the date on the photograph indicates the crash is gonna happen on August 31st. All I had to do was wait this out and not get into my car until September 1st. So I proceeded to barricade my door, blindfolded myself, and waited patiently in exile. All seemed to go smoothly until the afternoon of August 31st. 
being in absolute darkness has allowed my sense of hearing to heighten by 200%. And that's when I heard the ignition of my car turn on. My mama had taken my car. And that's when it hit me. The one driving my car in the photograph wasn't me. It was my mother. There was no answer. I tried again. No answer. After calling 76 times, I began to panic. That's when the telephone rang. Hello? Is this Ming? Yeah, that's me. I'm so sorry, Ming. It's your mother. She's been in a car accident. Why is this happening? So this story was cool and all, but you would not believe what happened the other day. I've always noticed this Pokemon movie was sticking out more than the rest, so I decided to take it out and inside was a mysterious USB along with a disturbing note that read, Watch this at night. I immediately pooped my pants 36 times. I flipped over the case and on the back was a set of strange markings with a hidden message. I scanned the ancient letters onto Alexa's database. In mere seconds, she was able to decrypt it. It read, It's your turn to play. Holy Toy Story. 3. This can't be happening. I instantly became Bob the Builder to see if I could fix it.